everyone. Today we're down at Jaguar Land Rover Asheville getting to check out this 2016 Range Rover. But it's not just any Range Rover. This is the SV Autobiography Long Wheelbase and it costs $200,000. And today we're going to show you why. And with a price tag of $200,000, that's competing with prices of supercars like a rear-wheel drive Huracan and a McLaren 570S. Underneath the hood, we have a 5-liter supercharged V8 engine pumping out 550 horsepower with 502 pound-feet of torque. That's nearly the same horsepower you get in the rear-wheel drive Huracan and a lot more torque. So this has a supercar price tag with an engine to match. Let's see what else it has. So SVR is Range Rover's special vehicle operations where they've taken the Range Rovers off of the assembly line and hand built all 160 that were produced. Today we are in one of 13 that is still available for sale. This vehicle has upgraded leather compared to the standard car, wood grain finishes everywhere, power everything everywhere, and much more. And being the extended wheelbase, the rear seat is where you really want to ride. So when you're in the rear seat, you have so much legroom, it is very comfortable, the seats recline. You can also press a button and pull up the adjustable leg support. You have power adjusting headrest for the rear seats. The entire seat does recline. You have lumbar support, fully adjustable, heated and ventilated controls, memory seating. Being in the back of this SUV is where you can take care of business or relax. You have a TV that you can take a look at using the handy remote control located in the center. And if you don't want anybody to hear what you're watching, you have Range Rover headphones. Now, to take care of business, let's pop out our portable trays. So now we have a great area to sit back and work on your tablet, but let's just say that you get thirsty while you're doing that and a normal cup holder just won't do. We go down here, push on this button, where you can see I've already conveniently placed my water bottle. You can fit a large bottle on one side and two glasses on the other, and of course you have the chill button to keep everything cold. So we have an engine that's worth the price tag. The second row seating is as luxury as the price tag indicates, but what about the overall materials of the vehicle? Leather covers nearly every bit of the interior. We have leather on the steering wheel and on the airbag. We have leather on the dashboard, the glove box, and the lower dash. Leather around the nav screen. Leather on the door and leather on the armrest. Of course, leather on the entire seats and extra armrests. And even making our way up to the ceiling, the entire headliner is made of leather with the A pillar and B pillar. You even get perforated leather. The sun visors have more of it on it. And naturally, the rear doors are completely covered. The seats, even this area right here. The entire center has more leather on it. Even the sides of the center console have leather on them. More leather on the ceiling back here. And you guessed it, there is leather in the entire cargo area and on the backs of the seats. And then finishing up with some plush carpeting that you would find in your house. If you're just chilling back and you want to listen to some tunes, you have a 29 speaker Meridian sound system. Let's find all those speakers, shall we? So we have some speakers on the door, some on the ceiling, one on the dash, more on the rear door, one underneath your TV, one by your ceiling vent, and some above your head and behind your head. Now we're quickly finding that the rear seat is where you really want to be. So what if you want a little bit extra comfort? Well, we'll go ahead and hit the massaging seat button. I'm sure that's pretty nice. What if there's a little bit too much sun coming in that side? Just pop up the automatic shade, and then, well, we have a nice panoramic roof, but it might be a little bit too sunny, so he can press the button. But then the other thing, what if the person in that seat is actually in your way? Well, just press the button, and you can put that guy's seat right up. I'm sure he won't mind. So now, what if you use that one button to move the front seat out of your way, but you really don't want to reach all the way? So we'll just go ahead and hit the front seat button, Using these side controls, you can just go ahead and move that front seat at your leisure. Once again, I don't think that guy will mind at all. Now one of the things a Range Rover is known for is off-road capability. So let's check out some of the cool buttons we get down below. We have a fully adjustable air ride suspension, all your traction control settings, different driving modes depending on the circumstance you will be encountering, including an automatic setting. You can check everything out on the screen and even turning the wheel around. 
it'll even show the different animations. But going through the settings, we have your normal selection, grass gravel, mud, sand, a rock crawl mode, and then just going ahead and pressing the up and down button, we can raise and lower the whole car. There's also a lot of storage compartments. Two in the door, underneath the armrest, which is of course cooled. The rear door has a few spots, the rear seat, and in the rear center console. Now we're getting ready to show you guys this off-road, but one thing to keep in mind, if it does go off-road, it has a wading depth of 35 and a half inches, so special intakes have been designed to keep water from getting into the engine. Now this particular car is not going to be going off-road today due to the price tag, but we'll take a shorter wheelbase of the same vehicle, check it out off-road. So, is the Range Rover SV Autobiography really worth $200,000? I think so. It's cheaper than a Bentley Bentaga, and yet it has every single thing that car can do. It can off-road, which I don't think it'll ever see off-road, yeah. but it can. It has the most comfortable back seats you can imagine. You can chill your drink back there, you can watch TV, you can have your headphones on, you can work on your tablet. You can adjust the passenger, front passenger seat if yep. you want a little more leg room. <laughs> Everything is power moving, you just press a button and it does whatever you want. And I'm sure the driving is pretty nice with a very, very powerful supercharged eight cylinder engine. Oh yeah, that would be a heck of an experience to oh, be yeah. chauffeured around. Yeah. It'd be fun to drive, but the back seat is definitely where it's at. <laughs> well everybody, that is our video checking out a $200,000 Range Rover. This thing is incredible with the luxuries it has. It's, it's fantastic, it yeah. really is. <laughs> Huge thanks again to Jaguar Land Rover Asheville for providing this SUV for us today. Definitely an awesome experience. Check out their website in the description below as well. So thank you all for yeah. watching. We're unfortunately <laughs> going to give this back now, but we'll see you all next video.